Oh, I don't know if you guys have played it, but Papers, Please is the most stressful game. I mean, I'm going to say more so than Cart Life, because Cart Life, like, you can tell it's very, like, scripted stories that are supposed to happen. Like, you, you know, not, not that that's not also the case in Papers, Please. Like, there's obviously scripted characters coming up and, like, specific stuff that hits at certain days and whatever, but... Man, just, like, the work you're doing. <laughs> like, you're just, like, filing through tons of documents, trying to, like, keep all this stuff straight, and then people just keep putting more and more demands on you. Like, it's just, like, your supervisor comes over and is just like, hey, man, all right, Shay, you need to let her in. I don't care about her documents or whatever, just let her in. And you're just like, okay. Dude comes up, hey, my girlfriend's coming through. You know, true love, gotta let her through. And you're just like, all right. So you got these, like, other names in the back of your head. But then there's, like, new demands every single day. It's amazing at just simulating insane, stressful work environment. Like, I've only put in, like, four hours or whatever. But I've already seen a couple endings. There's, like, the resistance movement and all this stuff going on. It is crazy. (laughs) Oh, man. And then, like, just... Like, it lets you go back to those different days and kind of change what you did that day but like we're just coming up on audits and stuff like information audits on all the stuff i've filed or whatever i don't know what that's going to do because i've been purposefully fudging a few documents to help the resistance or whatever and like that might finally have dire consequences for me uh there is um like way like weeks ago i missed out on rescuing my niece so that's all fucked like <laughs> Like, she's gone. Who knows what happened? Like, that's a weird little background stress thing. Like, yeah, you really need to go through the whole game and just, like, tread this fine line between getting arrested and, like, making enough money to cover your basics. Like, just basic needs. Like, you basically need bribe money to break even every day. Like, to, like, pay the heating bill and keep food coming in. And, like, oh, man, it is... It's pretty genius. Like, there's some great, great stuff going on so far. I don't know how long it keeps going for. Like, I would, like, yesterday I totally failed at, like, day 20 or something. And I was just like, oh, okay, I guess that's the end. And it's like, oh, no, you you just screwed up. Like, you can keep going if you do different stuff. Um, There's even minor changes. Like, it's like, hey, I used the Trank gun, so I don't get sentenced to death. And that's, like, it. Whatever. Like, some spoilers, I guess, for different endings. But... (laughs) I don't know. You, like, you can screw up certain missions and get arrested or whatever. You can piss off the wrong people. Like, the amount of stuff the game just has you have to keep in the back of your mind while just, like, fishing through documents. Because, like, there's a time crunch on all of this. Like, you want to process as many people as possible just to get money. But, like, I'm averaging, like, maybe ten people at, on a good day. So... That's not enough to pay the rent and all that. And, like, that's, like, the lowest class apartment. So, like, if you're doing really well, I imagine you could, like, kind of keep ascending the social ladder, even though you're not supposed to, because it's, like, a Soviet republic. Whatever, man. Um, Ten bucks. Papers, please. Uh, Really, really interesting stuff. Like, the alpha totally proved to be a cool thing. If If you're interested in Republic of Times, also on the dude's site... Uh, Lucas Pope, check that out. Um, I'm gonna keep playing, but this is just like an initial stress relieving talking some stuff out because man, heavy. This game is heavy in a great, great way. Um, it's almost Christmas time. What's gonna happen? I don't know. Probably nothing good. <sighs> New Year's just around the corner. I, I don't know. Papers, please. Available on Steam. And I think GOG. But yeah, 10 bucks. Well worth it.